Hello everyone, today is small overview basics about viable distribution. The viable distribution is a probability distrib distribution named after Swedish mathematician Valody Weibull. This model is popular statistical model for life and failure data in mechanical engineering. It is also used in other applications, static modeling of wind speed, weather forecasts and be another static data fitting. The advantage of viable analysis is the ability to create failure analysis with small samples. From viable plot can be read characteristic life and fa failure pro probability. The viable cumulative distribution function has an explicit formula 1 with three parameters. F is fraction failing, T is failure parameter, time or a cycle, sometimes temp temperature, Z0 is failure free period, big T is viable, charact viable characteristic life, B is slope parameter and A is best for natural logarithm. In most cases, can be used the two parameters viable form with failure free period t0,0. Zero, zero. We simplify formula 1 to formula 2 to characteristic life is if t small t equals big t. Then we have 63.2%. Now we can change formula 2 to another form, formula 2.1. Now we change the viable distribution in form straight line equation with y on the left side and x with slope m. From these straight line equations we can calculate the characteristic life and shape parameter b. The formulas can you see here. Viable, viable distribution is linear, linearized by logarithm. Shape parameter b can give info about life data. If viable shape parameter B is less than 1, then is early failure, maybe by, maybe by manufacturing errors. By B equals 1, it is random failures. It is not failures of life. If B is greater than 1, then we have time or a cycle dependent failures. And by B bigger than 4, it is late failures. Important point is confidence bonds, median ranks in viable plot. Because the viable analysis always involves a sample. The viable diagram therefore only corresponds to the samples. This creates stati statistical rates. You can make a statistical estimate of the, of the basic range. For this, will I confidence bonds introduced? The upper confidence limit is the 95% and the lower 5% limit. Median ranks are calculated with beta binomial distribution. You can use median ranks from table or calculate it in Excel with uh, command beta inf. Here you can see red curves is viable distribution and two blue curves are media ranks 5 and 95%. For tests with size samples n less than 15 can be used Bennett's approximations. Formula 3 with i is the rank order and n is sample size. General workflow carry out failure test and Step 1 saw the value of values ascending after assigning the ordinal number i from 1 to maximal number of sites. Calculate fraction failing with formula 3. Plot fraction failing in failure values t in the log chart. And after this, you can read characteristic life and shape parameter b. On, and finally, insert confidence bonds to, to check. I make practical bending test with. 10 nails, bend nails to 45 degrees until the break and not the failure cycle.
Here in table you can see i is ordinal number and t is failure values, failure cycles from bending test of my nails. I have an Excel tool and I transfer the values into my Excel. I just have to fill only green cells with values. Remaining calculation is automatically. You can see viable distribution of my bending test with characteristic life of 25 cycles and shape parameter B 2.47. The calculation formula and data for logarithmic chart can you find here. Here in additional sheets you can find table, tables. For example my bending test with a sample size 10 can you see here. With media ranks for 5, 15 and 95 percent. In video description you can find the link to download of this Excel. You can download and test itself. It was for today. See you next time. Bye bye.